Hey, what's up guys? Imran here, Monster Gadgets. I hope you're having a wonderful day wherever you might be. And thank you so much for joining me yet for another episode of Tutorial Thursdays. And today is an exciting one. We're looking at Adobe After Effects and we're looking at how to remove actual items from a video. So a few weeks ago, I did a tutorial on how to remove objects from photos in Adobe Photoshop. I'll go ahead and link that here so you guys can go check that out. But today it's about video and Adobe luckily came out with an update a little while ago that you can go ahead and take out any object that you want from a video and just make it vanish. So let's go ahead and jump into Adobe After Effects and let's see how we can do that. Alright guys, so we are in Adobe After Effects and the first thing you want to do is you just want to click and drag your file on here. I've already done that. Uh, so we've got this clip here. The first thing you want to do is once you get into After Effects is always change this to fit. So that way it gives you a better view and you don't miss out on any you know, the edges or anything like that. So once you've got the clip on here, this is what it looks like. It's This is a shot that I took in uh, Pakistan over uh, last summer. And as you can see, there is a what seems to be like a cow or some type of animal here. So we're gonna go ahead and remove that out of the frame. So it's a nice clean view of the river and the mountains. So the first thing you do is you come over here and you grab the pen tool. And with the pen tool, you wanna go ahead and go around the object that you wanna remove. So you just simply click and make a box around the object that you wanna remove. And it's gonna give you this little dark screen. So from here, you can also zoom in if you wanted to make sure you got everything that you that you need to. What I like to do is because I know this is going to be moving in this direction, I just want to extend it out just a little bit so I make sure that it gets it. And then from here, you want to click down to where you have the source name, the file itself. Go ahead and click on M and that's going to give you the actual mask. And in the mask, what you want to do is just click on, once you click on add, you want to go ahead and click on subtract and what it's going to do is going to take that portion out and it's going to show you the rest of the image so we're going to go ahead and zoom back out and i'm going to go to fit from here on the right hand side you want to go ahead and click on tracker make sure you've got the mask selected and then from here we're going to go ahead and let it track the actual clip itself so it's going to go through the whole clip and it's going to create little keyframes and this is going to move along with the object that you're trying to remove from the actual video and it's going to track it throughout the video so we'll go ahead and let it do that. Perfect, once that's done, go ahead and bring the video back to the front. Click on Content Aware Fill. This is a new feature that I'm talking about. And then from here, you wanna remove the object that's by default, go ahead and leave that. Click on Generate Fill Layer. And what it's gonna do is it's gonna go through and analyze the clip itself. And what it's gonna do is it's gonna take the content that you wanna remove and basically fill it in with the surrounding. So we'll go ahead and let it fast forward. All right, so as you can see now it's rendering. Uh, we'll go ahead and let it render and then we'll go ahead and play the clip back and see what it looks like. All right, now that it's rendered, now we'll go ahead and let it play. And it does a fairly decent job. It's not 100% you know, foolproof. If you look close enough, you can see something was maybe taken out, but for someone who has not seen this previously, and you look at this the first time, it's basically similar to the reflection you get in the water as the drone moving out. So I think it does a fairly decent job. All right, let's go ahead and jump out. So what do you guys think? Very simple to do, right? You literally just select the item you want to remove, boop, 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 drop a box around it, let it do its thing. You can grab a cup of coffee, step away, let the software do its thing. Now. Keep one thing in mind, this works probably for 70% of the times. There are scenarios where it's not gonna work well, so keep that in mind. Just because, again, it's picking items from, the item that you have selected, it's picking from the surrounding area. So if you've got multiple colors or you've got multiple surroundings, it's gonna try to generate small pieces and basically fill that in. So sometimes it doesn't work, so just keep that in mind. Uh, but for the most part, it does work really well. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, give me a big thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit that bell notifications so you're notified every time I upload a video. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.